So welcome here to the still headquarters. We're in our backyard and we've got an interesting demonstration to better show you the performance of the duro chain versus a standard chain, in particular when cutting in really dirty wood. We've got a couple of saws in MS211, one with standard chain on it and another with the duro chain. And we've pre-prepared a couple of logs. You'll see here three cuts in the end of the log. And in this we've put a mixture of dirt and sand just to simulate some really dirty abrasive cutting conditions that would obviously be very demanding on a chain. So let's see how well these saws perform. So as you can see there really is no comparison with this dirty cutting conditions. The standard chain just doesn't keep up at all whereas the duro chain just keeps going and going. So some real benefits there for a number of different users. The other thing that we might want to ask ourselves is what is it like with clean wood? So if we could compare the standard chain to duro chain in clean wood, uh, we can see here in this interesting exercise that it is very very comparable. So as you can see with these exercises, we've really promoted the fact that the duro chain has some real benefits, uh, not only just to a professional user or someone that has a really demanding task, but also to the occasional user that has the everyday little duties that they might want to do with a chainsaw, and they want that benefit of keeping a sharp edge. So it's great news that we can now add to the range with our new 325 pitch duro, and that means we even have a wider range of chainsaws that will be able to use these duro chains.